is the proof positive that salvation is by grace through faith in Christ's finished work. According to the Bible, not of ourselves, ano man, lest any man should boast. Dito sa pagkagaling mo, ano ang kaling tao na magpasigar ko? Ano ba'y tao na maghambog? Not of works, lest any man should boast. Okay, so, ito nga kita ka ron, na naay pre-crosses ng Calvary's Hill. Okay? Okay, illustrate. Naay cross sa Calvary. So, parang siya si Jesus Christ. Okay, si Christ. Okay, si Jesus. O niya, ang kaling niyang tapad, mga malefactors na gitawag sa Bible. Malefactors. Para mahin mong alliteration para sa akong lesson, ito ay consider ang mga mga introduction na linya. Pagkita na ito sa mga passage, yung consider passage o the cross. Okay? Or the place called Calvary. Calvary. Oh. Una, Calvary. Second is, na ito ang cross. For our study, mga siya ito ang guide ka ron. Una, makita ito ang place called Calvary. Then the cross. Then second is, nakita na ito ang the criminals. Okay? The criminals meaning the malefactors. One on the right side of Jesus and the other in his life. Okay. Sunod, nakita na ito, the Calvary, the cross, the criminals, the crowd. Okay? The crowd. And we have mga naglansang ni Christ. Then not only the crowd, nakita na ito ang, ito pa man, The Calvary, the cross, the criminals, the crowd, the Christ. Pakita na ito dahil si Christ. Okay. Calvary, cross, criminals, crowd of si Christ. And then sa last, pakita na ito ang conversion of the criminal. Okay. Conversion. Okay. Tama sa pwede? Of the criminal. Of the criminal. Okay, so what is that topic called? The Calvary, which is the place, the cross, the criminals, the crowd, the Christ, and the conversion of one of the criminal. Nai kaluwasan ba na ito po ito sa cross sa Calvary? So what is that? Ang tulukan karon sa ato mga lesson. Okay, so nakita natin na ito lo ka tao ang gisputan sa Bible. Na ito lo ka cross ang gisputan sa Bible. O na makita nato ang nakutang. May malefactors three, may criminal three yan, ako'y criminal three yan. One on his right side, and the other on his left. Wala ka sa Bible. Una, kung tayo ay consider the man who died in sin. Okay. In our lesson, sa itong introduction niya, sa ito ang kanina topic, in our introduction, makita ito ang unang point, the man who died in sin. Okay. Okay. The man who died in sin. At the cross, we see one man who died in sin. Okay, look at your Bible. Ano na ito sa tulong sa ino in verse number? In verse number 39. Okay, in verse 39. Look at your Bible. In verse number 39, the Bible tells us, And one of the malefactors which were hung railed on him, saying, If thou be Christ, Save thyself and us. Okay, you know, no? if thou be Christ, save thyself and us. They consider. So, what is it? 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 If thou be Christ, it is if thou be Christ, save thyself. Okay, you know, what is it? Save thyself and us. So, he wanted rescue. He asked for salvation. He asked for salvation. He wanted na ma-rescue siya from is kanang condition from his present situation. Gusto siya na maluwa siya sa iyang presente nga kahimtang. He wanted rescue. He wanted that Jesus Christ would save him. O na nito siya, if thou be Christ, save thyself and us. Pero makita na ito dito sa verse 39 Gabon, and one of the malefactors which were hung, layer to him, say. Okay, so what is siya na? Consider na ito siya as the cross of the railing scorner. Okay? The cross of the railing squared. Okay? He marked the Lord Jesus Christ according to what our text says. He marked the Lord Jesus Christ and one of the malefactors which were hung there to him saying, Okay, He, if thou be Christ, save thyself and us. Pero sa verse number 14, But the other answering rebuked him saying, Does not thou fear God, 
seeing thou art in the same condemnation, and we indeed justly, for we receive the due reward of our deeds. So, makita na to, makita na the man who died in sin. Ika tuha po talaga, dapat tayo consider the man who died from sin. Okay? The man who died from sin. O number three, consider na tayo siya, the man who the man who died for sin. Okay, so let's consider this passage or this context. Una, the man who died in sin. Sa katao na namatay sa ilang sala. Okay, so na naman, for this man or for that man wanted rescue without redemption. That man died in sin because he wanted rescue without redemption. He marked on the Lord Jesus Christ. His only and I'm called is his physical salvation. He only and I'm focused on material things. He only focuses on on his physical or the material aspects sa iyang pinagod. So, muna nga, this man died in sin. So, ito ha, the man who died from sin. It refers to the second man. Okay. So, considering na ito, muna siya ang isang katao who died in sin. So, on his left, this man who died in sin. Ito na, the man, or this man, died from sin. Okay, for the man in faith cited, okay, this is his word, for the man in faith cited the eternal liberty from suffering. Okay, this man cited in faith the eternal liberty from suffering. And not just the short term immediate relief from suffering. Okay, he believed on the Lord Jesus Christ. He trusted the Lord Jesus Christ. Ano man, ano siya? Lord, remember me when thou comest into thy kingdom. For oh, he cited in faith, he trusted the Lord Jesus Christ as his Savior. He trusted the Lord Jesus Christ as his Lord and personal Savior. That only Jesus Christ alone can save him. Amen. Dili iyan ka not his own works, not his religion, not kung siya iyang mahimo, but kung makita nito, this man trusted the Lord Jesus Christ that He is the only Savior and He alone can save his soul from 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 danger or from 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 hell. Ikan sa akin ang kalautan o ikan sa iyong pinto that only Jesus Christ can save him. So muna siya na, this man died from sin, but his soul is saved. Because the Lord Jesus Christ promised, gave a word, Today shalt thou be with me in paradise. And that is a message of hope. That is a message of assurance. Usa na siya kapulong na paglaong. Usa na siya kapulong na ito na kapasailuan. Isa na siya kapasalig sa Diyos. Nga ang kalag niya, hindi makangko na kaluasan. Okay, so muna nga, ang iyahang gidesire is ang iyahang spiritual salvation. This man wanted the physical salvation, but this man wanted the spiritual salvation. This man died in sin, but this man died from sin. So, the difference? Kita pang kalainan. This man died in sin, he remained in sin. He died in sin. Pero kanya siya, he died from sin. But from the moment he trusted the Lord Jesus Christ as his Lord and personal Savior, this man got the promise of the Lord Jesus Christ and again, on, today shall thou be with me in paradise. Ano man, because the purpose of the Lord Jesus Christ na namatay sa cross is this man died for sin. Okay? So, kanil siya, this man died for sin. So, kanil siya, consider na ito ang man that Jesus Christ is man. Because we believe in the Bible that Jesus Christ is man. Because the Bible says, God was manifest in the flesh. And we believe also that the Lord Jesus Christ is God. We believe that Jesus Christ is man. And we believe that Jesus Christ is God. Because the word 
the word na pakita na in the book of John, chapter 1, verse number 1. Okay, the notice of John, chapter 1, verse 1. Okay, look at your Bible in the book of John, chapter 1, verse 1. The Bible tells us, In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. In verse number 2, the same was in the beginning with God. In verse number 14, look at your Bible in verse number 14. And the Word was made flesh and dwelt among us, and we beheld His glory, the glory as of the only begotten of the Father, full of grace and truth. Now, this is word. The Word was made flesh. Okay? And an idea. The Word, which is refers to God in verse 1. Okay, look at your Bible. In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. And the Word was made flesh. Now, we believe in the Bible that Jesus Christ is man, and we believe in the Bible also that Jesus Christ is 100% God. Amen. We believe that Jesus Christ is 100% man, and we believe that Jesus Christ is 100% God. Because an order and is God manifest in the flesh for the redemption of the souls of mankind. Para sa katubsanan sa sala sa mga tao. That's the reason why the Jesus Christ was made flesh and dwelt among us. And we beheld His glory, the glory as of the only begotten of the Father, full of grace and truth. That's what the Bible says. But this man, which referred to the Lord Jesus Christ, this man died for sin. Kani kawana, namatay siya para sa sala sa tao. O isa ka blessing nga makita nato diri ah si Jesus Christ makita to ang iyang redemption nga gihatag diya sa Bible. Jesus Christ bore the sin of the believing people. Oh, this is word. Jesus Christ bore the sin of this believing people. Kita to Bible. And the sins of all who would believe upon him as well. O bisan pa man gani sa sala sa tanang tao nga musalig diri kaniya. So, muna nga, ang Bible sa in whom we have redemption through His blood, even the forgiveness of sins. Dari kaniya, kita makaako na katubsanan, pinaagi sa ayahang dugo. Okay, pinaagi sa dugo ni Christ. Ano ang redemption? By His blood, even the forgiveness of sins. Jesus was bearing the sins of the sinful people. O na makita na to sa, sa dito ya, Jesus was bearing, ipas na niya ang sala sa kadaghanan sa mga tao. He was bearing the sin of sinful people. Pagkita, He who knew no sin, kaya wala siya yung sala. He who knew no sin, but become a sin for us, that we might be made the righteousness of God in Him. Amen. So wala kita sa Bible, nga siya na yung sala for us. Tayo mo siyang sala pa naman para nga makaangkong ta sa pagkamatalo ng Yesa Diyos. Ano siya nga? Ipakamata ni Christ sa cross of Calvario is our sin. Christ died for our sin. Diba? Christ died for our sins. And that is the message of redemption. That is the message of hope. Minsahin na sa paglaog. Minsahin na siya sa kiyatak ni Kristo sa ato nga kapasailuan sa ato mga kasalanan. That's the blessing. Kaya kung ito'y consider ang Bible na ay kaluwasan di lang ang Kristo o wala na ay laing kaluwasan pa kung wala si Kristo na matay sa Kristo. Ang Bible na suti in Acts chapter 4 verse number 12, the Bible says, Neither is there salvation in any other, for there is none other name under heaven given among men whereby we must be saved. And that name is the name of Jesus Christ. Only Jesus Christ can save us. Wala ni lain. Only the Lord Jesus Christ can save us. Not our works, not our religion, dili ang kanang by keeping the law, but ang makahaka na itong kaluwasan is only the Lord Jesus Christ. Ang yan, dibuhat sa cross, kung ano siya makahaka na itong kaluwasan. He died on the cross for us, for our salvation. And we need to consider to believe what Christ has done for us. Believe with all your heart na ang yan, dibuhat sa cross, kung ano siya ang makahaka ng itong kaluwasan. Mas na naman ko na kaya pa muna kasi Jesus Christ namatay ang lubong o pagkabanhaw. Pag ito consider ngayon kamatay ang lubong o pagkabanhaw para sa atuwa ko siya. The death, the burial, the resurrection of the Lord Jesus Christ is for us. Consider to accept the fact and to believe it with all your heart that Jesus Christ died for our sins. So, maraming isipot na ito sa Bible. 
Oke, okay, semua nah, satu interaksi kita untuk the nine,